Hey guys, it's Avali, and guess what? I'm in Switzerland! Yes, this is amazing. I'm studying at the University of Geneva for a semester, and I didn't bring my camera, which is why I'm filming with a selfie stick and my phone. Yeah, I know, super Asian, but like, whatever, I'm not vlogging this time. It's too stressful. <laughs> I'm just gonna make videos when I'm bored in my room alone because I have no friends. Okay, I thought I should give you a room tour before it gets messy because trust me, it will. It's gonna get super messy in here. So this is the view from my window and it's actually pretty great. I'm on the fifth floor and I really like it so far. So this is my desk and I love that it's really huge and also they gave me two chairs. So I'm gonna have a lot of study space. <laughs> okay, procrastination time over here. Oh, also check out this free bag that I got from orientation and this free like student guide diary thing. And this is my bed, nothing fancy, but I get a lot of cupboard space, which is super cool. Obviously, I can't reach that far because I'm short. There's also this extra small table thing. I'm using it for food, but I don't know. It's just a random thing that sticks out for no reason. I get a sink in my room, which is super cool, but the kitchen and bathroom are shared. This is the mirror. I'm like kind of too short for this, but hey, you can see me and the wardrobe behind is for clothes. Cool. But yeah, speaking of shared spaces, like the kitchen and whatever, I haven't been here very long. I only just moved in a few days ago, so I don't really know how things work. Anyway, I was looking for the fridges and I just kept walking around because all the doors are kind of locked and I was like, is this someone's room or is this like a communal area? I couldn't figure it out, but I saw this one door at the end of the hall and it was open. So I went to have a look and bad idea because that was some guy's room and thankfully i didn't see anything don't worry but it was really awkward and i was like sorry and then i ran away like back to my room to hide in shame and um last night i was trying to cook oh the kitchen is awful by the way the stove doesn't even heat up for like half an hour so yeah i was i was just really annoyed by that it's not convenient at all so i was cutting onions Yes, you know where this is going. So obviously my face was like super red and I was like crying and just not having a good time. And then someone comes in behind me and they're like, oh, hi. So I turn around and I'm like, hello, with my face all wet from the tears and all of that. And then I realize it's the same dude that I accidentally like walked in on. So now he just thinks I'm really creepy or weird or something. Unfortunate, I'm not very good at making first impressions, but I'm starting classes next week and hopefully I will make some friends. Good luck to me. <laughs> so as you can see, the lighting is not so great, but you can tell it's really bright outside and that's fun. So I'm gonna go and explore. Oh my God. <laughs> This is so great. Come back up. Oh my god, this is so entertaining. Do it again. Oh my god, it listened. Oh. I almost forgot to say goodbye. I'm sorry. Before I go, let me know what kind of things you want to see in my videos. Do you want to see like, travel type stuff or more embarrassing stories from my life? Leave them in the comments and I shall check them out. Okay, have a great day. Bye.